This Friday is Women's Entrepreneurship Day, empowering the four billion women worldwide to be catalysts of change. But here in Minnesota, we're celebrating it early, and tomorrow you can join others for the state's inaugural event. That's right. And joining us this morning to tell us more about it is Ambassador Laura Keller and entrepreneur Nina Hale. Thank you both so much for coming in. Thanks for having us. So I have a lot of female friends who are entrepreneurs, and I will say there's something really special when you get them all in a room and they start <laughs> talking about ideas and it gets very exciting and inspiring. Tell us about what people can expect at this event. Well, we have a great lineup of women entrepreneurs coming uh, to share ideas and their origin stories of how they started, um, what hurdles they came up against when they started their company, and stories of how they succeeded and um, paying it forward to the people that come to the event. Nina and Laura, you both are working moms, you work full time, you juggle the act of marriage and kids, And but how will we see that come to life? Because I know the theme here is spirit, grit, and growth, the key message, Nina. Well, I do talk about in my speech about how important it is to have buy-in from your friends or your spouse or your family and how much that helps but also just the depth and importance of how much you learn and, and what it does to bring out that potential that's always been locked inside of us. And Nina, we know that you uh, own your own ad agency. And yeah. Laura, you also founded Pixie Dust. Tell yes. us about that experience. Pixie Dust is an executive search firm. I co-founded it with Ashley Maybod. And we focus on placing leaders, leaders in marketing across the country. So it's, it's been um, a really interesting journey and um, it's been a great, a great company. And Nina, I think too, especially when you're running a business, I think people think, wow, how does she do that? But I think it's also okay to be vulnerable and let people know that there are hardships and it's not yeah. easy to do everything. How can women who attend this event get a little inspiration from that? Well, uh, there's so many good things and amazing things that happen to you when you start a business. And what I like to say, and I'm going to say tomorrow, is that even if it's not successful in the way that culture deems as success, it's going to be because the amount that you learn and everything that comes out of it. But I do tell a couple of stories about how sort of some of the grit sometimes can be road rash. Mm. <laughs> Just gotta stay along for the ride. Well, if anyone yeah. is interested in attending Women's Entrepreneurship Day, Minnesota is tomorrow at Pica in St. Paul. It is a great venue. It's from three to 6.30. Tickets are $25 in advance, 30 at the door. We have details at WCCO. And we 